Hey man, you ever gonna make your rag? Yeah, I got this. Watch. I got this projector online. Cool, huh? Both the compartments should be well lighted. That includes properly operating red lights. The space's overall appearance should be clean and fresh. The temperature should be comfortable and you should be able to breathe in fresh air. Lockers and bunks should be well maintained. The sheet metal in good condition, no broken or bent doors, hinges or hasps, and the escape panel unobstructed. Paint should also be in good condition. Ventilation piping should be clean inside and out and in good repair and there should be no obstructions in ventilation piping. Fans should be clean and in good repair, and no unauthorized alterations to redirect airflow. Again, this is not the place to get creative. Passageways and privacy curtains should be clean and in place. Mattresses and pillows should be clean and in good condition. Bulletin boards should be present and contain relevant material, like the plan of the day, watch quarter and station bill, other posted material as long as it's public or private should be appropriate. Cleaning gear lockers should be clean, well vented, and properly stowed. No dirty swabs or other matter should be present. Birthing spaces are critical because this is where your sailors live. Sanitation, ventilation, electrical safety, storage, and escape routes are some of the things that you must look at every time you go through a birthing compartment.